Regarding Chase checking accounts, there are five total. All of them include free online bill, pay, and banking, free account alerts, and telephone access to your accounts, and access to the 15,000 Chase ATMs, and then you have a Chase debit card and mobile banking. All those are free. Now, be sure to note that if your phone provider charges you for texts, that won't be free, but it'll be a minimal amount. Now, one thing to note is they do offer student checking, which is great, and yet, at the same time, it's not that great because there are checking accounts out there which offer interest. Now, I've pulled up a chart that shows their interest rates on the Premier checking and the Chase um, Platinum they offer 0.01% on every balance, which is miserable in truth. But in most cases, what you want from a checking account is access to free checks and things like that. Let's see what they have. So this gives you the, the basic checking, gives you the free access, and um, there's a $25 fee, transaction fee for non-Chase ATM withdrawals, USA, USAA offers you a refund on your ATMs, which works great, and this is not provided by this checking account. Uh, the better banking, uh, there's still the fee, and for check images, there's a $3 a month fee. Monthly service is waived if you have 1500 or more, okay? Why go with that um, when you can choose the ATM fee? Uh, you have no fee when you use the Chase Premier checking. So, you also have no Chase fees for um, Premier style checks. And then you also have the minimum deposit. Now, the catch here is that you have to have a balance of 15000 or more. Okay, Premier checking. Let's go ahead and look at that. You have a bunch of free things and very few fees, and you can link accounts, so on and so forth, $100 minimum, and you must have 75000 or more to open an account. So, if you don't have that much funds, forget about these sweet benefits and look for another bank. If you do, then this is where you want to bank. So that's just a little bit about the accounts they offer. We, the last one we didn't talk about is the student and high school checking accounts. Um, this has great benefits, but once again, there are better banks out there that do offer you rates because, honestly, 0.01% is very measly. If you want to read more about this review, just be sure to make sure uh, check out banktruth.org in our bank reviews under Chase Bank, and you can learn more about some of the details on that. Thank you for tuning in to banktruth.org, and we'll be back later.